All right, hey guys. So today we're gonna to be doing some um, something a little more interesting. I'm actually gonna be doing some molds today. Um, and I figured, what the heck, since I did resin. So I picked up these really, I picked up this really big container of resin. Hey, I picked up this really big container. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, big container of resin. And this is the resin that I'm using anyway, so I just picked up some more because a lot of my molds are, are here um, and they're not at the foundry. So I figured I'm going to do, um, I'm going to actually pour one. But first I have to get some things picked up because I'm going to put it over here. So I'm going to pick up some of these things so that we can, here, I'll bring this down a little bit. And I think you guys can see. So I'm gonna move some of this stuff because you know I was doing the alcohol release yesterday. And so okay. we're gonna pick up some of these things. Tiffany, can you help me pick up some of this stuff? No. And I've solicited my son to help me. She's uh, making me do it against my will. <laughs> so we're gonna just pick up some of these things. Tiffany, grab the these containers and just put them over by the sink for me. Just put them inside the sink. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to pick up all of this stuff first. That's what we're going to do. We're going to pick up all of this stuff first, get all of this picked up, and then sand brush, because actually we did some really nice alcohol release yesterday, which was cool. Oh, let me move that because we don't want this. This was one of the ones. This is an alcohol release we did yesterday, which was awesome. So we're going to move all of this stuff and put it somewhere else because we're going to use this space today. We're going to use this space for molds. And I'm pretty excited about it because I did do, I did try it out on my, what is considered my buttkin people. <laughs> and I'm still doing some more of those. I'll be um, pouring another one of those. So I'm just gonna move my plastic around a little bit so that I can straighten it out. There we go. And then Timothy, we're going to do, um, let's see. So we're going to grab a couple of, of my molds. So, all right, so we got that picked up. Ta-da! And over here, we're going to grab a couple of my molds so that we can get that part started. So, Timothy, the one that they're heavy. So, let's do the one um, over on that side. Well, actually, we're going to go over here. And I don't know if you can see it. So, I'm going to turn you this way so you can see. Can you see anything <laughs> over that way? Maybe this way. I'm going to bring you over right here. Those are where my molds are right there hold on let me see i'm gonna come over there so i'm gonna turn you so you can see um in there so my moles are over there and so let's see let's see which one of these we want to do so i was thinking if i shorten this this might be a fun one to do and then um and then i was looking at sanctuary because i do like Sanctuary as well. So I think we will. Let's do, we'll do sanctuary. I think, yeah. You ready? You want to grab that in? I'll grab this in. Okay, I got this in. You ready? All right, so we're going to bring, we're going to bring this big one over. I don't know if you can see it. All right. It'd be great if my camera's turned. So stay right here a second. And then I'm gonna turn it. You got it? Okay, right, then I'm gonna turn this Of course. Oh. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna turn this around. This way, again, I know. It's wild. It's this is my cameraman. <laughs> Me. I'm my cameraman. So we're going to take this one and, all right, um, let's put this way. There we go. So this is one of my bigger molds and I figured, what the heck? I got resin, so I might as well use it. Let's pull it to the front a little bit more. 
and then we're going to lay it down. So, there we go. And I'm wondering if I can do two of these. Here, Timothy, let's move this one over, and then we'll grab another one. Ready? Okay, there we go. So, now we're just going to grab one more. Grab, go ahead and grab that little one. So we're gonna grab that little one. Can you get that one? Can you get it? It's, is it too big? So we're gonna grab one more. And so I wanna make sure this is angled correctly. We're gonna move this back some. So we're gonna grab one more and then I'm gonna get these prepped. Two, and then we'll put this one over here. All right, got it. So get your side. And then we're gonna bring it up and down right there. So thanks, Timothy. Yeah. All right, that's it. So now I have two. I'm gonna do two molds oh, today. Huh? Okay. And what I'm going to do is I have to prep them because they are they have dust. So let's do this. Do do. So I do have to I do have to prep them because they have dust in them um, because they've literally been sitting <laughs> they have literally been sitting over in my little section for a while. Hey, somebody say hey. Uh, so they've been sitting in my little section for a while. So what I figured is I'm going to just go ahead and um, so I'm going to blow some of the dust off with my trusty dusty uh, blow dryer. I'm going to use that to blow some of the dust off. And so right now I'm just going to be prepping. I'm just going to prep everything here. I'm going to actually do the pouring of it on live on, um, on our free quarantine page. So if you want to see, if you want to see me pour it, definitely head over to creative quarantine because that's, where I'm going to actually pour the resin into these really large molds. I'm going to bring you down a little bit so you can see what I'm doing. So right now, um, because these have been sitting in my studio, they've gotten dust in them. And I have a dust um, sprayer, but I'm going to use this first and kind of get some of it out before I use that. Oh, let's get that. And I'm gonna lift it up a little bit because I want it all to go out. Get all that. All that. Yeah. Get in there. 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 Like I said, like I said, these have been sitting around my studio for a little while, so dust has gotten on them, and so I'm trying to get a lot of the dust out. But I wanted to use this before I use the dust off. Because if you know anything about dust off, it gets cold. So I wanted to use the blow dryer on cool before I did the dust off. Now the dust off does blast it. It'll blast anything else out. But as you know, look at that. See? The dust off gets really cold as well. <laughs> that little piece did not want to go. So what I'm trying to do is, is uh, there. So I got, whoop, I used the dust off. So that gets, um, I think that went, actually went up <coughs> my nostrils, which I didn't want that to happen. So, um, and then I'm going to do this one, pulling this over. This doesn't, I mean, it's the same thing. This one doesn't have as much.
There we go. So this one didn't have as much dust in it. And it looks like my camera might be a little twisted. So sorry about that. So this one doesn't have as much dust on it in it. And so I'm happy about that, that it didn't have as much dust in it. But I am going to still use the dust off. Because sometimes there's little particles that I can't see, but the dust off will get it. There, go. Now, so these are all prepped and ready to go. Um, I'm going to spray, I'm gonna sit here, and I wanna make sure that everything is fitting into where it's supposed to fit. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Like some of the, uh, some of it might not be fitting into areas and just look at it and see if there's little things here and there uh, that might need to come off or I might see little particles. So, and then like I said, I'm just making sure everything is in the slots that they're supposed to be in. Cause there's little keys and when you make molds, they have little keys and all the little keys have to fit into their key slots. And if they don't, it kind of rustles things up a little bit. Um, so I'm just gonna, I just wanna make sure everybody's fitting into their key slot. Some things are sitting up higher than others, but I'm not going to pour this whole thing, but I'm going to pour her. And then some of the leaves here and there, I'm gonna to try to pour some of those. We'll see how high we get. So I'm gonna to try to pour some of the leaves and her, um, but I'm not gonna pour the whole thing because it is. this is huge. This is a huge piece. So basically I'm going to pour um, into her and then we're going to get some of the leaves and some of the plants. I just wanna lift this up a little bit because I'm missing a spot. I'm missing a key. This key isn't going in very well. So I just wanna make sure this key is where it's supposed to be because I wanna pour this particular one. So this one's all ready and good to go. And, and the other one, see, that's a key. You see that? I don't know if you see that, but that's a key. So this one's ready and good to go. And then this one, I'm not gonna pour all the way to here. I'm just gonna pour to here and up here and just get all of this, of this one. Cause I don't want to pour all the way down here cause that's a lot. I'm just trying to have some fun and see how, you know, just have a look at it and see what it is I like and what I don't like. And so we're just gonna have some fun with these. I'm going to put some color in it. And the reason I put two, I'm not sure how far that'll go, but I put two just in case. So that way, if I have left, if I have uh, more than enough, then I'm going to pour this one. And then if I still have some left, I have, um, I have the buttkins around, so I'll pour some of them too. I have several molds that I can pour in. So this is um, what I'm going to be doing today on um, on the show. So if you're interested in seeing me, if you're interested in seeing me pour these molds, definitely tune in to um, Creative Quarantine today because I'm going to be pouring these molds in Creative Quarantine today. And Creative Quarantine starts at two o'clock my time. So that means um, a little less than an hour. So head over, if you're on Facebook, head over to Creative Quarantine, our Facebook page, or Louise Cover Studio page, or um, Art for the Soul Gallery, Larry Poncho Brown. You can also find us on YouTube at Larry Poncho Brown and the Beauty of Black is Fine Art Show. We're on YouTube on all of those places. So definitely check us out because we'll be there. All right. Bye. Uh, let's see. And right, let's do that. All right. So I will see you guys later on. Definitely check us out on the Creative Quarantine today. 
because this is going to be a fun one.